Well, families of students who attended Aurora Middle School were informed today their children may have been exposed to a person with tuberculosis. Yeah, in a letter, they were told there is no ongoing risk for TB exposure, but those who came in contact with the infected person does need to get tested. Health specialist Kathy Walsh joins us from Aurora Hills Middle School now tonight to talk a little more about this, Kathy. You know, in this letter, school officials are not saying if the person who has TB is a student or a staff member, they say the exposure would have happened in the fall semester. Students were in school today. All staff and students who might have been exposed are being contacted. Denver Public Health, Tri-County Health, and the school say they're working to test anyone potentially exposed. They say it is safe for students and staff to attend school and participate in activities. That doesn't allay the concerns of one mother. She didn't didn't want me to share her identity, but says she's been told her son is one of the people potentially exposed. I was very upset because when they shared um, that it was out in the, this is person, individual has been since the fall diagnosed. Um, why are they not being more productive and proactive at this point? Um, and why don't they have a testing facility immediate? Why couldn't they immediately be in there testing the children? Now, she says she's been told testing will begin on Tuesday. According to health officials, TB is a disease carried by or caused, that is, by germs spread through the air from one person to another. Getting TB typically requires many hours of contact with a person who is sick from TB and has symptoms such as cough, fever, or night sweats. Most people who are exposed do not get infected. People who are infected might not get sick at all or don't get sick until months or even years later. For much more on TB, Denver Public Health will hold town meetings here. One tomorrow night, that's Thursday night at 6 p.m. The next one next Tuesday night again at 6 p.m. In Aurora, I'm Kathy Walsh covering Colorado First. All right, Kathy, thank you.